my loves, Lynette here, and today I'm going to be processing Irish moss. Um, I talked about Irish moss already in the powder form, but I'm going to be processing the whole leaf uh, wild crafted fresh Irish moss. And you can see right here how it looks in the bag. Irish moss is a seaweed, and so it comes right out of the sea. It smells like the sea. Um, but it has no taste. So we're gonna go through how you process it. Um, we're gonna wash it. Okay, normally I process it by boiling it in water, but some people, they say some of the nutrients may come out and then others say it doesn't matter. So I'm gonna try a different form of processing it this time. The other recommended way to process this is to let it sit in water overnight. So I'm gonna see and see if it's the same as when I boil it, it kind of expands. So I'm gonna get a little bit out, we're gonna cover it with water, we're gonna let it sit overnight, and then we're gonna run it through my um, food processor, and then we'll see how um, it comes out. Okay, the first thing we're gonna go do, we're gonna take some out of there, and you don't wanna take too much because it does expand in water. So you wanna take a little bit, a little bit goes a long way, and then I don't want it to last too long, so I'm just gonna take some out, show you how it looks. See, as you can see, it's just like when it comes out of the sea, it has a lot of salt. I don't know if you guys can see the salt granules on there, but it's pretty salty, and then they have some debris in there, so you really need to rinse it well. Get all of that salt off, the, off of there. Okay, we'll talk a little bit about Irish moss. It has 92 minerals out of the 102 that your body needs. It helps cure anemia. It's a good source of energy. It treats thyroid disorders. Um, it relieves respiratory problems. It boosts mental health. It promotes recovery. It improves skin health. It aids in quick digestion. It helps in weight loss and prevents radiation poisoning. All right, I'm just gonna put it in a strainer. And see, that's all I'm processing today because I don't want that much because next month I'm gonna be doing a 30 day, um, I guess fasting consecration where I fast for 30 days, uh, just the juice fast. So I'm gonna save for a lot of my Irish moss and then till then. And so I'm just going to process this much today. Maybe I'll put a little bit more. And, and then I'm going to make smoothies out of them. Okay, so then we're going to just kind of rinse it. Get all the debris off of there because you want all that off. Get all the salt that you can. It's still going to get on any of that sea salt on there. As you can see, that is how it looks after it is nice and washed. And you can kind of tell the real from the fake. They're making a lot of fake Irish moss um, nowadays and they're bleaching it. And you can see this is the real color. It's not really white. So that's how you can tell that you have real Irish moss. It's not really white, it's a little um, yellow. And I think I'm gonna rinse this again because as you can see, I see a little bit of a discoloration somewhere. Let me see. I thought I saw something right there. I see a little bit. I don't know if you can see that, but I'm gonna rinse that out. I'm sure it doesn't matter, but I'm a little picky, so. We're done. There you have it. Irish moss, washed, ready to be processed. 
All right, now I'm going to just put it in the bowl. And since it, Irish Moss usually doubles, well, triples the size. So we're going to put it in a bowl and we're going to cover it with water. And then we're going to come back tomorrow and then we're going to process it in um, my food processor. So we'll be back tomorrow to do that. Let me get the water first, put it in there. Okay, I have a couple bottles of water, so we're gonna just pour that in and let that cover it really well because we want it to expand, so we want it to cover it. Put that in there. I think I add a little bit more and then I'm gonna cover it. And we'll come back and see how it looks tomorrow. moss has expanded um, about three times as much and we'll just open wow it's pretty much almost filled up the whole container here so yeah we're gonna pull it out of this container I'm gonna rinse it off again and then we're gonna process it so we're gonna take out the Irish moss and we're just gonna rinse it again and then we're gonna process it. As you can see, I now have to hold it in two hands. That's how big it kind of uh, expanded. processor okay now we're gonna just dump it into our food processor and what I like about using wild craft at Irish moss is that you can make smoothies you can put as much in, it in your smoothie as you want and um, you just get those nutrients it helps with a lot of energy I mean it does everything the pill does but to me Irish moss is a wonderful source of minerals it's an energy booster it adds nutrition to your diet so I always love to put these in my smoothie. I can definitely tell the difference. I'm not hungry at the end of the day when I use it. And it's just a great additive to any food. Um, you can put it almost in anything. You can put it in your bread. You can put it, of course, your smoothies. You can put it, um, you can add it to some of the hot foods that you're making, or to your gravies. I've seen them do that, but we're just gonna cover it. You just wanna cover it Lightly cover it with water, just like so. And as you can see, how much I put water to about here. I'm gonna grind it up. I'm gonna put it back in our container and put it in the refrigerator. So we processed the Irish moss. Now it's time to pour her back into the container and we're going to put her in the refrigerator overnight and then I'll bring you back um, to show you the final results. Okay, I rinsed out my container and now I'm going to pour my Irish moss back into this container to sit in the refrigerator until it solidifies. So you kind of bring it into a liquid and then it's going to solidify into the refrigerator and you can just scoop this out and make your smoothies or whatever else.
So I'll be back after this is done sitting for a few hours and then we're gonna make us a smoothie. Okay, the, today is the next day and here is the consistency of my processed Irish moss. I have to say that um, when I boil it down, it's more of a smoother consistency. This is, as you can see, looks a little bit um, granulated or whatever and then the water's not quite mixed and that's different than um, when I usually when I boil it, I mean, that's different when I boil it um, with that method of processing than letting it sit, but it still works for me. It's still kind of thick, so that's the consistency. And like you said, now I can't smell. It doesn't have any smell once you do process it and it doesn't have any taste. Okay, since it's in the morning, I feel like a fruit smoothie. So I, as you can see, I have cut up some apples, I have some blueberries and some frozen mangoes. And my apples are fresh, but my blueberries and my mangoes, they were frozen already because I like my smoothies to be kind of like a, well, I like it to be cold and frozen, frozen, a frozen smoothie. So I'm just gonna add a couple. I'm gonna get three since it's not as thick as, as it normally is. I'm gonna add about three tablespoons of that Irish Mars, so I'm gonna do another one. <laughs> All right. And then also I like to add a little agave to it. Not much, because I don't like it to be too sweet. So that's the agave. And then next, we're gonna add our liquid. And as you can see, that is unsweetened coconut milk. Just gonna add a little bit. And the more liquid you add, the looser it is, so it depend on the consistency you want. I don't want too much, so I still kind of want it to be thick. So that's all I'm going to add of my liquid. Add our top to it. And then my blender. And that's the way it looks all mixed up. Now I'm going to pour it into my cup. So that was my smoothie. Irish moss is a health booster and it's a great way to add minerals and nutrition to your diet. So remember to like, share, and subscribe. And remember you're beautiful and I love you. Bye.